Thanks. Well, some parts of the viewing area, like he's been saying, saw just a few sprinkles, but that sure wasn't the case in the village of Deschler. That town is dealing with a mess after five inches of rain yesterday. Tatiana Cash was in Henry County tonight to see how residents there are dealing with it. So, Tatiana, what did you see there? Well, Melissa, Jeff, it's never great when a boat will work getting down your driveway. We did find a few residents dealing with some headaches, but overall, people were just trying to make the best of it. These kids say they woke up for vacation Bible school and found their very own mini water park. I like it. I do too. It's fun to play in. Summer break brings summer storms. WTOL meteorologists reported Deschler getting about five inches of rain after it was all said and done. The storm dropped about two to three inches in like 90 minutes. We walked outside and it was about like ankle deep to us both. So we had to figure out a way to get on the other side of town. Because they say the other side of town was fine. And I noticed that like one half of town was flooded and the other half wasn't. So while it was business as usual for many. It's the black swamp, so it's kind of hard to get rid of the water. Huh? Just have to wait it out and uh, be patient it's about all you can do. Some vehicles and residents were in need of some drying out. They say this isn't the first time they've seen this in the village, so there's no use in getting upset. No, I don't feel that we really need any help, and I don't know what it is that they could do different. My nephew's father and my nephew are on the other side in a boat <laughs> canoeing through it, and some people are just driving through it or swimming in it for fun. Now, when I asked about how long they think the water will last, one resident told me that it could take at least a week or more, especially if it rains again, which unfortunately is in the forecast for them. Live here in studio, Tatiana Cash, WTOL 11.